<laughs> what was that? Control. Interact. So I can't, I can't do anything about the volume on this one either. Look, devs. Look, devs. You got to have a volume option. Always. Always. We'll make sure it's not too bad. I, like I said, I've got you guys pretty low, so hopefully it works. It's getting a little louder. Mom, you're home late again. Come on, I was busy with work. Can you have some sympathy for me? But today is my birthday. Oh, oh, of course. I know that. Then where's my gift? Is this too loud? Mom, uh... Hold on. What if we take it... to here? Have you ever heard of Mr. Redface? On the birthday of good children, Mr. Redface secretly leaves gifts while they are asleep. Really? Of course. If you want to get your gift, you have to go to bed right away. I'm going to bed right now, Mom. You're fooling the kid again. How many times have you come home this late? I was working, and my shift ended late. Bullsheesh. You still think I'm an idiot, don't you? Hey, little shit, get back to your room. <laughs> don't stand there eavesdropping on grown-up conversations. I'm pretty sure I was here first, you psycho dad. But okay. This is a bad situation. Can be such a good voice actor. <laughs> Thank you. Wait, why are there two beds in this room? Is this my room? And a vanity? This can't be my room. I gotta get out of here. I'm gonna get a whooping. There we go. Hopefully, Mr. Redface. Visit us. Maybe? Hello, Mr. Redface. gift. It is Mr. Redface. For me? Not my closet. <gasps> is that the gift from Mr. Redface? No way. <gasps> He's cute! It looks like us. Hi, I'm Ron. The doll has a name? Or did the doll just talk to us? <gasps> it talked to us? What? You can talk? Of course, because I was created by magic. You even have the same name and appearance as me. 
That's right. My master made me just for you. But your neck seems a bit loose. It's okay. Sometimes my master makes mistakes. This is just a, a small flaw compared to the other dolls. What's important is that from now on, I'll be your best friend. That sounds wonderful. Do you want to play something with me? My master stole, stored my toys in the closet. Can you get that from me? We definitely saw him go over to this closet. The closet is still stuck. Can you try that again? Um, sure. Here we go. I've tried my best. I can't open it. Do you want me to do something else? I'm hungry. You're a doll. Can you even eat? No, you'll be the one eating. But I'll be able to feel everything you eat. My master linked all your senses and emotions to me. So I can easily understand you. Wow, that's amazing. That's exactly what I was going to say. Amazing. I don't think we should eat those. Those look like pills. I set our doll down. You're reading this letter at 1 p.m., aren't you, sleepyhead? I've prepared your favorite dish in the fridge, so remember to heat it up before eating. Lately, I've noticed you've been getting lazy about eating. You know I don't have much time at home, so please learn to take care of yourself and stop making me worry. One more thing. Don't forget to take your medicine after eating. Mom. Okay, it is our medicine. Okay. We're going to wash it down with some, uh, I don't know, bottled water. Is that your favorite dish? Do you want to see me perform some magic? Yes, please. All right. I'll make this plate of food never run out. I don't want to have to eat all that. Every time you finish eating, the dish will be restored to its original state. Wow, that's amazing. What else can you do? What just happened? I don't know. You guess. Oh no, the bottle. My dad's gonna whip my ass. I hope he's still asleep. Your dad? Don't worry, my master has taken your dad away. What did you say? Bro, we need to we need to take our medicine. We gotta go check on dad. Right here. <gasps> How'd you get in here? Where's my dad? As I said, my master has taken your dad away. Why? Because your dad is a bad person. He often hits and yells at you. Parents like that aren't taken away by my master. Ooh, parents like that are taken away by my master to protect children like you. But this is too much. 
My dad doesn't deserve that. He is a bad person. No, he's not. Please, let my dad go. I'm begging you. All right. All right, but my master won't like this. It's quite a long way to where your dad is being held. You'll have to use a shortcut if you want to get there in time to save him. Show me the way. The shortcut is through your closet. I mean, do we really, though, after after finding that information out, do we really want to go get Dad? You still can't open it? That's disappointing. I guess we'll have to use your parents' closet then. Okay. Do the closets go to the same place? You should know that these closets can function as portals. They can take you anywhere you want, including your dad, including where your dad is being held. Give it a try. The text is so blurry. It's like really hard to read. There's nothing in here. Oh, right. I forgot. There are a few steps you need to take to activate this shortcut. Bring your dad's radio and place it in front of the closet. My dad's radio. Okay. This radio will work like an elevator button. You need to select a frequency first. If you choose the right frequency, the door will open to the place you need to go. And what happens if I choose the wrong frequency? Seems like that's not it. Let's try again. We're gonna drown. The lady from the opening credits? <laughs> is that it? I think this is the one. Go ahead and step in. I'll stay here and watch the house. Okay. Reception. What's up? I'm looking for my dad. Describe. My dad's name is Bruce. Wait a moment. There are many Bruces here. Any more details? Is this Bruce a good Bruce or a bad Bruce? Well... My dad is the kind of person who gets a bit angry. So he's a bad Bruce. Let me see. There are still many bad Bruces. More specificity. Spe specific. Spe More specifics, please. <laughs> what else does he do? <laughs> He often yells. <laughs> God damn it. Still not enough information. Sometimes he hits me. And slaps too. And? That's all. The door is behind you. The door to my Bruce? My Bruce dad? My dad Bruce? The right, Bruce? <coughs> Boo. Just got startled? No. Who are you guys? Just like you, we're kids on our way to find our parents. We're staying here for a bit. Do you want to join us? I'm sorry, I'm in a hurry. Okay, see you later.
Okay, through the door. Dad? Please stop punishing me. It's me, Dad. Please stop punishing me. What has he done to you? Come on, let's go home. Or Mr. Redface will take both of us. Please stop punishing me. Uh, Dad? Spell. Ah! What happened? Are we a doll? Mom? Hey, what's wrong with you? Why are you hiding in the closet? Mr. Redface has taken Dad. Oh? Well, that's a good thing, then. I'm not joking. It's a long story. Let me explain. How is your doll Ron doing today? Is he all right? The doll? Mom, how do you know about it? Of course I know. Since you haven't taken your medication today, this isn't the first time you've had such hallucinations. Every time you tell a different story, but the common factor is always that stupid doll. Don't you remember the previous times? No. I don't know what's wrong with you. Just go to bed. It's midnight already. Okay. Sh I mean, should I take my meds now, or...? Mom? Okay. Just checking. Can I take my meds now? Nope. <gasps> what are you doing? Look. What just happened, son? Are you all right? No, damn it. Mr. Redface strangled the sheesh out of me. Do you feel better now? Yeah, Mom. It's Mr. Redface. It's all right. Tomorrow. I'll take the day off to stay home and take care of you. Really? Promise me, Mom. I promise. Now go back to sleep. Yes, Mom. Mom? You've broken the promise again. Maybe Mom is Mr. Redface. Plot twist. Maybe she's went to sleep in our room. <gasps> our doll has been beat to heck. What happened to you? My master beat the shit out of me. He wasn't happy about what happened yesterday. I'm sorry. This is my fault. By the way, have you seen my mom anywhere? <laughs> my master has taken her away. 
What? It just happened. I'm sorry I couldn't stop him. You should run away, because he'll come back soon and take you too. No, I have to save my mom. And my dad too. How? Don't you see what he did to me? I found this at my dad's prison. I think it might help us defeat him. That, that's the spell to defeat Mr. Redface. Come on, quickly go into the closet and find where your mom is being held. Back to the parents' closet? Here we go. Kids are hiding. Quickly, throw the spell in here and take cover. Nothing happened. Liar. Oh, maybe I gotta go over here with the kids. Mr. Red Face. I guess back through the closet. What's happening to you? My master has been defeated. The magic he cast on me is also fading. Are you... disappearing? Don't worry. This is what I wanted. You should go outside and see your parents. Okay. Dad! Mom! Y'all are free now. You've been having an affair, haven't you? I told you. I was busy with work. Liar! You've neglected this family for another man. Aren't you ashamed to lie to your son? And what about you? Do you think you're better than me? You're just at home, leeching off me all year round. What kind of father are you? No matter what I do, it's my business. I still bring money home to support my child. And if you still think I'm a whore, you're lowering yourself even below that. One more word. Fine. You and I will get a divorce. One of us will have to move out of this house. If you're still here tomorrow, I'll take my son and leave. You stay right there. Um... Hey guys, I'm... You forgot about me? I'm... Dad's drinking. This is bad news.
I won't let this happen. Mr. Redface is our alcoholic dad. No. This can't be true. I'm very sorry, Ron. Your closet. I think you're able to open it now. This is... me? Why don't I know anything about these? You've always known. Because I am the knowing part of you. You've tried to deny and reject these things, and made up stories to make yourself feel better about you and your dad. And me? I have to find a way to lead you back to the reality. I've tried many times, many ways to help you accept this truth as easily as possible. And every time I fail, guess what happens? Tick-tock. Boom. All the memories disappear. You once again wake up. At the, at the starting point, which is the night your dad murdered you. How long have I been dead? Fourteen days. It can't have been that long. What really happened to my parents? As for your dad, he's hiding in a cheap motel. And as for mom? Oh my god, that's why our neck on the doll was all crooked. Go home with me, Dad. <laughs> what about my mom? She still sees me, doesn't she? That's right. Because she's only home late at night. But if it's daytime? Son? Do you have any clue about your husband's hiding place? You just dropped something, ma'am. No, we did. What is that? It's a motel card. But I'm not sure it's mine. Father arrested. 
lot of subs, I know, right? Uh... <laughs> Sorry to be a downer. <laughs> oh my god. Bad parenting. It's true. It is bad parenting. How does that story? Is that dad? 